Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Burnout. Yeah, this was the game with the most votes, and here we are. Burnout 1, the humble beginnings for Criterion Games, published by Acclaim in 2001 and some other stuff. Yeah, let's go wreck some cars, shall we? <laughs> so we don't have a save data, so let's go and quickly make one. And just like in Midnight Club, let's just use our initials. So TMC. Nope, not TMD. Nope. TMC, there we go. I've actually never played this. This will be good. Oh, CK, you never played the first Burnout? Well, I I've played it. I like it. Prediction for how many crashes that TMC will have? Um, it, Probably in the hundreds. That's what I'm expecting. So, uh, yeah. Burnout. Not much else to say about it. <laughs> And it's going to be hard for me to read chat just because, you know, like, I'm reading comments off my phone. And, um, yeah. I heard this game is excellent practice for GT Sport. Oh, yes. It's per it's the perfect practice for either Spaniards in Europe or Brazilians in, in the Americas. But anyways, so this is Burnout. It's a relatively short game. We expect to beat this game all in one sitting tonight in one stream. And uh, a solid 85. <laughs> a bit too optimistic. Yeah. Yeah, it's a bit too optimistic. I think we're probably going to think about the hundreds. But anyways, championship mode. We only start off with five cars. And we're going to use the first one, the Super Mini, for the first championship. Because I feel like it. And I want to paint it white. Manual transmission. And the very first championship in this game is the Journeyman Grand Prix. And we start off at the Interstate. Let's go. Don't know why they didn't include this game with sportsmanship videos. <laughs> And we're back. I just went ahead and quickly adjusted my controls because I forgot to assign the triggers to be the accelerator. So here we go, the official first race of Burnout on the interstate. Got another Super Mini, got a pickup truck, and I'm not sure who's leading. So yeah, let's get these near misses, try to get the nitrous up. Only five gears with this car. We arcade boys. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm gonna crash so much in this game reading the chat. So far, so good. Already took the lead. This Super Mini has some really tight handling, so don't really expect me to lose the car too much. Obviously, gonna be try drifting around the corners to build up the nitrous meter. There we go. Now we got the boost. Gotta be careful at these intersections, though. Don't want to crash into anyone. I'm, like, trying not to read the chat as much as possible. Jesus. <laughs> See what happens when you look down on, the, on your screen? Oh. <laughs> Thank you very much. Are the cars in this game fictional or real? Oh, they're, they're all fictional. Every single Burnout game has fictional cars. Crash counter one. <laughs> We're gonna keep a crash counter. All right, sounds good. That's what this game was about. No, definitely, definitely. Um, it wasn't really till the second game where it had the crash mode, but um, yeah, you're not supposed to crash in the races. Not supposed to do any kind of super dirty driving until Burnout Three Takedown. But I'm getting too ahead of it myself. But uh, jeez, I, I mean, you, you know, this is going to make the LP more interesting because I'm literally reading the chat. Oh, okay, how did we not get taken out? Whatever. Um, I'm literally reading the chat from my iPhone. So I had to literally look down on my knees because I have my iPhone hanging there. Like, I, I have my iPhone literally on my knee against the table. And it's not an ideal place to read chat. And so it increases the likelihood of us crashing. And that's what you guys want, right? How? I know! I know! How the hell did we not get wrecked? Alright, now we got the nitrous. Let's go. Let's go, baby, go. Almost got a full burnout, but not enough. Second lap. Whoa! How the hell did we not get taken out by that truck? Okay, now we got the boost. Jeez. This is kind of scary, honestly. Like, oh my god, did we be through all this traffic on the freeway? Like, 
I, it, seriously, this is really serious. TMZ needs to needs that anti gravity iPhone case. I know. Literally, like I'm gonna be reading all these comments really late, guys. So excuse me for that, but I'm trying to read them at a good time, or at least what I think could be a good time when there's no cars around me. Hit hard on the brakes into the intersection. Oh my god. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ, not even slowing down <laughs> can help. Oh, at least with... Oh, that's the muscle car. This looks so fast, we're only at 140 miles an hour. I know, right? I know you're just speeding through the interstate, but you use the turn indicator. <laughs> Two. You guys are really going to keep track of all the crashes in this LP, huh? Well, I do appreciate that, and, um... Yeah, definitely, um, Burnout 2 won't be necessary because obviously there's going to be a crash mode, so we won't need to keep track of all the crashes. Definitely for Burnout 1, it will, you know, it won't make sense. It will make sense. I'm, like, nervous right now. Like, I, I've never been this nervous playing the game before. I'll be honest with you guys. Like, I said that right when you crash into a truck. <laughs> yeah, the curse of CK716. So yeah, once again, excuse me for reading the comments late, guys, but, um, oh my god. Come on, give me the drift. There we go. Well, we're still leading the race. Ooh. Even compared to GT Sport mode. <laughs> I know, right? The driving school for the Brazilian players in GT Sport. Well, except for some. Some Brazilians are good, like the CRT guys and my teammate, Ducho Truda. But, um, yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Final lap. Okay. Can we get a perfect lap here? And get no crashes before the end of this race? Shifted down to fourth by accident. Because on this controller, X is to shift down, Y is to shift up, and that's something I have to get used to. I'm so used to shifting up with B down with X. Just gotta thread the needle here, just don't crash into anybody. Keep it safe. I actually like how the traffic cars actually swerve out of the way. Like, that's actually really cool. A nice little touch. And so is the in the the blinker. All right, back on the nitrous. Not that many traffic cars in the way, so yeah, you know what? We're gonna go on the oncoming traffic and try to build up the burnout meter because we need all this boost to ensure victory. My God, that was so close. How, how did we not get wrecked? Is that guy driving on the wrong side of the road? What the hell? We're gonna go on to oncoming traffic. Risky boy. Oh, get out of the wall. Get out of the wall. Thank you. Oh my god. The muscle is right behind us. Oh, jeez. I'm getting off the nitrous. Screw this. Okay. We win. Thank god. Whew, what a start. Oh, and a little tap from the muscle car. Nice. All right, guys, let me go ahead and save the replay for this race. Well, there's no replays that you can save, but there are crash replays you can save. So let me go ahead and save the crash replay. And as you can see, there are the statistics of the race. So we caused $129,580 of damage, finished first, got three credits still, and continue. Insurance damage. <laughs> I know, right? So yeah, um, we didn't get the record for the fastest time. We didn't get the record for the fastest lap. 
and I guess no record period for damages. But hey, round number two is going to be at Harbor Town, and um, yeah, here we go. Now, this is more of a European track, so expect a lot of windy roads. I hope you're not paying that. TMC never pays his insurance damages. That's why I never carry my insurance when I go driving, and I never pay when I crash. I, I crash into people all the time. I never pay for those damages, because I'm an OG. Oh, Jesus Christ. Not so much. Because I'm just literally scared playing this game. Like, Wow, that muscle just hopped over the curb big time. Whoa. Jesus. Clean overtake. Nope. Did the over and under. Oh, the pickup truck wants him too. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Van. Memes everywhere. Damn it. Come on, hit the truck. Yes. At least we got the truck. And the muscle? Yes, the muscle got hit too. At the very last second. So we're at three. Crash number three. Yep. Oh, dude, just wait till the wait till we get towards the end of the game, which will happen tonight because this game is short. Jesus, I couldn't even see the car coming. Anyways, um, yeah, just just wait till we get towards the end of the game because then it gets even scarier. And it's final two, four, four and a half. Because I wasn't paying attention to the screen. Okay, we got the nitrous for the first time in this race. Let's go. See, I like how you can hear like the heartbeat or whatever when you use the nitrous. That's a really nice touch that they added. That I mean, I'm not sad that it didn't come out in the other games too but it was nice for this game you know I think like Burnout 2 had a way more aggressive feel and obviously Burnout 3 is on a whole nother level so this is that was a nice really touch for the first game oh my god oh my god wait why am I using nitrous why okay well we're using nitrous might as well stick with it it's not really smart to use nitrous in this section of the track Nice drift. Oh my god. <laughs> that I just was bottled by adrenaline. <laughs> okay, so far so good. Again, why am I using nitrous in this part of the track? This is a slow section. Am I that ruthless? Oh my god! <laughs> How did we not die? A uh, traffic jam. Let's give TNC some skill points for those dope drifts. Oh yeah, where are my sponsors at? After that drift, another drift. Chris Forsberg takes the win, even though he hit the wall. <laughs> As I say that, number five. Whoa, okay, here we go. Final lap. Oh my god, that was nearly number six. Oh my god. Had to take evasive maneuver there. How we didn't get wrecked, I don't know. Don't even ask. F? <laughs> Thanks for paying respects. <laughs> oh my god.
Okay, do not use nitrous here again. Come on. Come on, Elmer. Don't use nitrous here. Please, for the love of God. Use nitrous when we get to the bridge. Be smart. Now get on the bottle. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, so far so good. Whoa. I feel like every time we start to get comfortable, they throw like a big truck at us on the small little streets. All that drifting. How do you still have tires? Next in tires, bud. Hankook. All right. Only a few more corners to go. Now we get on the nitrous at this final section. And we win. Thank God. Woo! TMC getting sponsored. Oh, yeah. So, $139,000 and 400 no, $139,402 worth of insurance damage, more points, and still have three credits. Ooh, we got the fastest time for Harbor Town, fastest lap for Harbor Town, second highest score, and that's it. Your winner. <laughs> We will play big rigs one day, I promise. So I should mention one thing. Reason why we have credits is because you don't have, there's no points in these championships. If you look at the second column, it says position required second. That's the minimum position to actually win the championship. So yeah, you have to get these minimum positions and if you don't, you lose a credit. It's kind of like an arcade game from big rigs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'll, I'll definitely play big rigs on this channel one day. I'm, I promise you guys. I'll give you a hint. Oh, I'll give you a, a, basically a spoiler. It'll be on April Fool's Day. Three, April Fool's Day 2019. But in 2018, we're green at... I forgot what this place is called. River something? So yeah, all we need to do is finish second place. Wow! Two car pile... Four car pile up. Everyone... Oh, never mind. The Super Mini escaped. Now, we will be safe if nobody start decides to merge. Oh my god. Get out of here. Get out of here. Screw this. So next year. Yeah, next year I'll play Big Rigs Over the Road Racing um, on April Fool's Day. I'll do an LP of it. I, I'm, I'm dead serious. Even though that game barely functions. <laughs> See, like, these intersections scare the hell out of me. And then you have this... Roundabout here, this traffic circle. Oh my god, that was a slow speed crash too. There's crash number six. Okay. We're still leading the race. We still have a pretty big nope n not anymore we have a pretty sizable gap between myself and the second place car which i think is a super mini there's number seven because i clipped the damn inside wall what <laughs> he didn't even like he didn't even bother turning the damn car That super mini just went straight into the wall, like freaking Maldonado style. There. That's a takedown. If it was Burnout 3, we would get more boost. <laughs> oh my god, see? That red car was trying to merge when the truck was already there. This scared the hell out of me. Like, I don't even care about the nitrous, honestly. I just want to survive. 
That's it. I want to live. I have kids. Well, I have a daughter. Well, a dog, but yeah, you get the point. So I have too much to live for. Can't go on the opposite side of the road. My god, see? See what I mean? I knew the damn intersection was going to bite us. Take down. <laughs> You just want to drive slow because you can't afford the insurance premiums anymore. <laughs> I know. I've been paying too damn much. If only I had the general. <laughs> and my phone fell. So I can't read your guys' comments right now. Sorry about that. But I gotta focus on this damn race. That was crash number eight, I believe. Where's Mikael and, and Pleb King when you need them? They probably wrote it down. I just can't see. Okay, now we get on the button and start the final lap. Sick drift. Now we can go on the opposite side. Cause I just need that extra boost to ensure that we can pull away. Because I don't want to deal with any of the shenanigans with the other cars, honestly. Had to ride the wall there to avoid complete carnage with the bus because I just do not feel like crashing into it. Okay. Where are these cars going to come from? Yep. Knew it. That's two for two. Three for three. Awesome. Can we make this a perfect lap? Up to fourth gear, up to fifth gear. I think we can make this a perfect lap. My God, that van was speeding. God damn it. Of course we couldn't. A super mini again! Okay, so this is an interesting thing I should know about this game. If you crash too many times, the music gets even more dramatic like it just did right now. But unfortunately, we already finished the race, so you can't hear much of the track. That is my favorite song in the entire game, by the way. The one that just played. So yeah, $184,000 worth of insurance damage and still have our three credits. And yeah, that's the Germanyman Grand Prix we just completed. More records. And we unlocked the Big Run Grand Prix, the face-off number one, and several tracks. So next up on Burnout, we're going to do the first face-off.